Who is Lala? <laughs> That's such an interesting question. Uh, Lala is a woman. <laughs> It's an interesting season, you know, and I think the most interesting thing about my journey is it's so unpredictable. And I think I've positioned myself to be ready to go anyways. I heard about the Lady Boss on, on social media. I think so. It was a social media. Um, I have known Lady Biba, um, not even really personally, just knowing the brand and knowing that, you know, if you wanted to look hot, corporate, powerful woman, you better wear Lady Biba. Because I don't wear Lady Biba. What are you wearing? You know? So that was the vibe. I was trying to rework my portfolio and I had seen it and I was like, okay, Gazmadu and Lady Biba are partnering. That's interesting. Also because I've known Gazmadu's work also online, but I'm like, this person photographs women very well. You know, like if you just go to her and you're a woman, you will come out glorious. Like something is going to just shift, you know? So I was very excited about the collaboration and it was like a budgetary thing. Ah. Take picture, pay this amount, use dress. I said, I'm inside, you know. I was trying to be intentional about positioning myself as a leader in my industry, as somebody who influenced decision-making in my industry. So I knew that I needed new pictures. And you know how you're like, when people Google you or when people are inviting you to speak, what pictures of you do they have? After a while, you have to be intentional about changing the photos out there. So... I was just like, okay, I'm going to do this. Like, you know, and sometimes a photo shoot is hectic and stressful, but I think the, the partnership made it easy because your outfits are selected already. Um, you pay a certain amount of money, which wasn't like a high rate or what you would pay if you walked in on another type of shoot and guys knew exactly what to do, you know? So that's how I heard about it. That was why I did it. I thought it was time to just reposition myself and, put out that lady boss, you know, um, image, you know, that I was becoming, you know, you have to, you have to become the image that you want and you have to be intentional about putting it out there. So that, that was my motivation and that was why I did it. My experience at the lady boss session, even in 2019 was really good. Um, Gad was very pleasant. She was very welcoming. Um, she was also, I could tell that it was something she loved to do. Um, I think the, the, the best part for me was her like literally posing me, like telling me where to put my hand. So those, I was just like, Hey, so those powerful pictures, it's not as if it's a people's spirit. They just know what to do. You know, she would say, stand like this, do this. I said, Hey, this is the expo. I didn't know, but it was very pleasant. It was very joyful. Um, I liked the, in the ambience. I like that she was very, she curated the ambience to suit me. She, you know, she asked questions. Um, it was very good. The experience, you know, during the shoot was very good. It was very pleasant. It was very quick. I remember when I posted the first one, I think, I don't know whose comment it was. You know, somebody was like, look, I've seen you in pictures. I've seen you are fine. But you see this one, it has power. I said, that's it. You know, there was something about it. I still use some of those headshots till today because they're so timeless. You know, for, yes, so timeless, so relevant. Five years later, you know, um, it was very, it was very like, and then it was clean, you know? So when you're like, who's this boss lady? And it wasn't like forceful or, you know, horrid. And then I looked like myself. So it did what it needed to do. Um, I was able to change the pictures, uh, you know, my pictures online, you know, people want to invite you somewhere, sending out your profile, your headshots. Those pictures came in really handy and they were solid. I recommend the Lady Boss shoot to every woman, every woman who's trying to position herself as a leader in her space. Sometimes, eh, even if you don't have anything, you know, sometimes you want something, but it's important that you feel it by yourself for yourself first so if you do the lady but even if you just want to blow it or put it in your house start from there you know and i think that you know there's a principle i say a lot that what you consistently behold you will eventually become so even if you feel like ah it's for the bosses and you think oh you are not a boss do it you will become a boss because you will be telling yourself and telling the world that this is the image of me that I want you to have. So I definitely recommend it. I think people should do it. Doing the lady boss should put, put you in a network of women. 
you know, so you are in like the Lady Biba network, you are like in the Gazmado network. And then all the numerous women that these women have clothed and photographed, you are now in that network. You are seen by them, you know, and I think that's a plus. And that's even a stylish way of networking, you know, repositioning, tweets. What is enough for the West?